Welcome back to the channel, ninjas. Joey Moss with Bad Boy Game and Skittink. We got the new War of the Spark bundle. Ten boosters up inside of one of these. What are we gonna find? I have no clue. Hopefully something really good. Also, Jeff Kaufman sent me something to the good old P.O. box. We're gonna crack that open throughout this. Thanks, Jeff, for sending that out. But let's get into what's inside War of the Spark bundles. We've heard these, they've done these differently. So I'm just gonna flip it on the back real quick. The ultimate battle begins. A single planeswalker is a force to be reckoned with. And how? An army of planeswalkers represents enough po raw power to reshape a world or destroy it. Here, planeswalkers from countless worlds have converged for an all-out war that will decide the fate of the multiverse. You get a player's guide, <clears throat> 10, 15 card booster packs, War of the Spark card box, spin down life counter, color varies, two reference cards, an 80 card land pack. That is what has been different inside of these. What we will find that is good is entirely random. You never know what these, oh my God. Don't steal. Bad things will happen to you. You end up grabbing your ankles and then get slammed up the back. You don't want to get slammed in the back, do you? No, don't steal, kids. Bad things will happen to you. Why they throw these in here? Anyone have a clue? Can someone please inform me why this box is in here? It doesn't really house many cards, and it's odd to begin with. I just, you can't, I, stop it. Garbage. And then you do have this nice little book right here, War of the Sparks. They do come with a little bit of information on how the cards work and everything. Pretty awesome, I must say. And if you haven't seen the theme packs by now that I opened yesterday, oh my God, go back a video. You guys are gonna flip out when you see that we pull. That was just insane. Can we top that today? I doubt it, but holy smokes, we're gonna give it a go. So that's what you just get up inside one of these plain books. Pretty cool, um, Planeswalker books. Oosh, the spin down. All right, everyone, guess a number. Guess a number. What's it going to be? What's it going to be? I'm going six. Eleven! I wonder if anyone got that right. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, we got booster packs galore. On your turn, deck building stuff. Good stuff for newbies. But what's inside of here? I heard they're going to put a bunch of these um, foil cards inside of here. Is that true? Is this true? Are there going to be foil cards in here? Right now I'm just seeing an 80 lamb pack. Have we been duped? Did they, have we been lied to? Have they changed this? I don't see any foils at all in here. What is going on? These were supposed to be completely different. These are all basic lands. No foil cards, as they said. I'm really confused right now. I thought we are supposed to get five foil lands or ten foil lands, something like that. It didn't seem right. It didn't make sense. I don't know the source on that, but that, that was the rumor floating around. I'm not sure I believe that rumor anymore. That is odd. I'm sorry, guys. I had to get that out of the way, though. Um, yeah, I thought we were supposed to have a bunch of stuff in here. What happened to that? It's like it, it just changed it, man. Um, we're starting off with Bond of Disciple, Eternal Taskmaster, Casmina, Widespread Brutality. Really interesting card. And Elite Guard Mage Foil. There you go. It'd be cool if they put, like, a foil in every single pack. What do you guys think of that? If, like, maybe these bunt... No, that'd be overkill, huh? You think it'd be too much if they put a foil in every single one? That assassin token is magnificent. She is gorgeous to look at. You can touch me with your death anytime. No, I'm just... I, I, yeah, no, she can't do that. She, I don't want to die. All right, um, but that is crazy, huh? That is crazy. All right, here we go. Reaver, the Strike. Cruel Celebrant, great card. Davin's Veto, another great uncommon. Hot Lay, of course. And Plain Wide Celebration. I think I've pulled more... Plain wide celebrations than anyone in history. That's correct. Even people opening 10,000 boxes right now. I, I've pulled more plain wide celebrations than they have. I know, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy. Seems like every single box I get one of those. Uh, pretty interesting, I must say, to say the least. Guild. The Rioteers. All right, pretty cool. Tyrant Scorn. Voice of the Pack. And Finale of Devastation. That gets a little bell there. Not bad. Finale of Devastation is a great, powerful card. It's still keeping its price point. I think it's up there around 10 bucks still. This token's a little bench. Not happy about that. Mm -mm. Not at all. Not at all. Should be on Twitch tonight. There is, has been an issue with my internet for some reason. Um, it's causing blackouts every now and then. I, I'm not sure what's going on with my Twitch, man. I'm going to try to go again live tonight, but I do have the cable company coming out. That's a great card. Uh, Jace, Wielder of Mysteries. I have the cable company coming out later on this week, so um, I am looking into the problem. I will tell you that. 
I don't think it's on my end. I think it's on the cable company. Maybe you need like a new router or something. Something has to happen though, because um, I, I end. Has this happened to any of you guys? Any of you guys are really tech savvy out there? Tell me what you think it could be the problem. What's happening is I got a command of the dread horde and a cura. Um, I go on to OBS and I start recording, you know, whatever. And then like it, just, the signal just starts dropping off. Like it starts, it goes yellow and then goes red, and then like it, it stays red for like. Three seconds and flashes orange, back to red, orange, red, and then it goes way back up to like 500 kilobytes per second and it stays like that for a short while. And then we get a sore and vengeful blood. Uh, blood Lord, not bad. I, I don't know why it's doing that. And if anyone has any idea what is causing that, I would really like to hear about it. Um, but yeah, it's like every 20 seconds it does that, maybe 30 seconds. So it's just something that is causing a lot of issues on my Twitch where it's hard to live stream and I'm really worried about it. So that's why I had the cable company come out for my patron live stream coming up. So Tahiri, God Eternal Bantu, yeah baby, give me that guy, I'll take that all day. Someone's dad pulled this the other day, I'll say that, I gave him a little heart, mm -hmm, that's true. Brag about your pools guys, let's hear about it man. Brag about your pools, or tell me a cool pool story. You know, maybe you were, you know, you were hanging out. It was hot summer, you know. She had a glass of iced tea. You had a willingness and a filthy mind. And you just decided, you know, to walk on over to her with your charm and all your masculinity. Next thing you know, you had a heartwarming time. And you triumphed all over Nyssa. And pulled the Ajani the Great Hearted and you guys got married. Tell me about your pull of story. Soren's Thirst, not bad. Cool foil on that. That one's a nice foil. Um, they did a really good job on that one. Uh, but yeah, I'd like to hear about your pool story. You know, maybe it wasn't iced tea, maybe it was lemonade you were sipping. I mean, things change, guys. I understand. I just cool, it's cool, it's cool. No doubt, no doubt. Uh, we do got the crush this. We got the one of these, those. Uh, band together. Not bad, not bad. Ba, Domery's ambush. Challenger troll, Davriel. What did I tell you? I can't stand this card, man. It just keeps coming up. Ah, go away! But everyone in Commander, Commander, I don't care. And we're not, I'm not, I'm, I'm standard, bro. For meow, for right meow. It's just seven, such a high casting cost. I don't even know if it's going to see much playing Commander, honestly. It's not even that great of a card. Uh, a Johnny's Pride Mate. Bond the Flourishing Sahili, style two bucks right there, and a Mobilized District to finish off this bundle. Not too bad. I mean, it was very underwhelming compared to other ones, but pulling two Mythics, that was kind of like the highlight of this. Not bad at all. Jeff Kaufman, what did you send me, homie? Let's get to cracking this open. I appreciate it. Always some uh, some craziness. Never know what to expect out of these. I think that's why I enjoy opening these on camera. Um, I like doing my fan mail on camera, guys. I think it's a lot of fun. I think it's more interactive. You guys, I mean, it's a personal experience. You can share, you know, um, when I open one of these. Let me pull this back off camera. Okay, return shipping address with paid postage. My ninja, doing things the right way. Get that right back to you. Inside we have this. There's no letter though. There is no letter or information. Maybe inside of here there is. I had a feeling. There it is. All right, from Jeff Kaufman, Joey Moss, Bad Boy Gaming. I enjoy your videos on YouTube. I saw when you cracked open a War of the Spark booster box. Very exciting, nice pools. I can't wait to get my box Saturday. I am sending a little gift surprise. If you can sign my full art lands and send them back an envelope, thank you. Keep cracking my ninja. All right, full art lands, I will send them back to you. And we got uh, this guy, a little Rouse chilling here. Full art lands are going back and some crazy surprise. You sent a lot of stuff. Oh boy. So these are the full art lands you want signed. Pretty sweet. Kaufman, um, are these for me, man? I can't wait to get my, um, I'm sending a little gift surprise. If you could sign my full art lands and send them back, that's it. Okay, these are for the channel. Holy crap. All right, Sarah Disciple, Resolute Watchdog Foil. Are these all foils, my ninja? You are quite crazy, my friend. Fencing Ace, nice, nice. Uh, Mistral Charger. Oh, I hooked it up with some foil. These all foil, oh my gosh. Lunark Mantle. You are you are one crazy and wild guy, my friend. Welcome, guide. Elite Skirmisher. Cool. I like the orbs, man. Those, those are like really kickballs. You guys know that, right? Those are kickballs. Everyone knows that. that yeah, those are kickballs. Uh, that's the most high priest foil. That's cool. Saving Grace. Wow. Oh, Dombringer Charioteers, man. I like this card. Um, four drop. 
There's the promo version, Flying Lifelink, heroic. Whenever you cast a spell that targets Dawnbringer Charioteers, put a plus one plus one counter on Dawnbringer Charioteers. Pretty cool card. Imagine that in standard right now. That would see a lot of play. Uh, Novice Knight with the Defender all up in it. One drop foils. Silent Sentinel. Man, you went all out here. Knight of Sorrows. Pretty sweet. I like, I like, I like looking at foils. I just got to be honest. I just love foils, man. Foil anything, baby. Whirlwind Adept. Stupefying Touch. She's like, no, I'm not yours, dude. You're stupid, uh, basically. Claustrophobia, cool card. Uh, the Grasp. Ooh, Chemistress Insight Foil. Dang, man. That's a, probably a pretty penny. Like, no joke. That's pretty cool. That is nice and shiny, my friend. Sapphire Drake up in here. Aether Tunnel, another cool card. Omen Speaker. Did they say omelet? It's omen speaker, guys. Arcane Denial Foil. That's another cool foil. I, God, I can't stop. I just get so excited with foils because they just, they're so shiny. I mean, just think, I, I feel like I'm a baby right now and I'm just looking at stuff. Mana Leak Foil. I'm just looking at it like, oh, that's so shiny, baby. Borrowing 100,000 arrows. I remember somebody had me sign one of those. Hydro Blast Foil. Now, that is sweet, man. From Eternal Masters. Daring Thief. Nice. The rare. Rise from the Tides. Times two. Both versions. That was neat. Thought Scour. Love this artwork. One of my favorite artworks. It's really dark. Really like, um, like it almost reminds me of Matrix. What was going on there with Matrix, you know? It's just crazy sauce. Uh, Sultai Skullkeeper. Sudden Storm. Centaur Battlemaster. Now that's nice. This dude's, he's about to get curb stomped and there's not even a curb. <laughs> Jeez, man. Briar Pack Alpha. Those things look ferocious. I mean, just get a look at them, man. Sometimes you just got to look at it, guys. Thunderherd Migration, another cool one. Rampaging, oh yes. Heroes Bane Foil, another cool. Uh, this one looks really different. Something's weird about this. Heroes Bane, though. Heroes Bane enters the battlefield with four plus one plus one counters on it. For four, put X plus one plus one counters on Heroes Bane, where X is its power. Pretty nasty card there. The Cartouches. Oh, who remembers the Cartouches? I remember the Skadooshes. Lanamore, Caravan, uh, Sartiad, whatever. I'm not going to read every single one. I think we should, though. Cultivate Foil. That's a good foil, my friend. It really is. Font of Fertility. That's a promo. I don't even know what that promo's from. 2014 is back in the day. Pretty nice, man. Ceratoc. There's a boar. There it is. Boar, tribes, boar tribe life matters. <laughs> there you go. Oh, lay waste. Destroy target land. That's a cool foil. Love the love the foils from back in the day. Burn bright. Looks ferocious. The seismic stomp. So the curb stomp was true early on. We do know this. Mog flunkies times two with a splatter thug. Fabian Katha. The Core Clan Wrecker. The Core Clan Wrecker. Battle Squadron. This was a, a, a rare back in the day. Did you know that? Undying Rage. Frenzied Rage. Direct Current. Oh, I love that, man. Anything with the flames and the fire and stuff. It looks like he's like got the spark of the war right there. He does. He does have it. Oh, a Tally Primal Storm, man. Love that card. Seen it so many times. Still love it. Can't get enough of it. Cannot get enough of it. Tormenting Voice. Bada bing. Horror of the Broken Lands, Asphyxiate. It's pretty cool. The Maggot, Bog Taters. <laughs> what? Vicious Rumors Foil, pretty nice. Child of Night, Vengeant Vampire. That is sweet. Um, two of them. That's a really cool card. That is a really cool card. Revenge of Vampire dies, destroy target creature and opponent controls, and you gain four life. Pretty cool. Charnel Troll Foil, nasty right there. House of Guild Mage. And to close it out, an Enigma Drake foil by Ninja. Jeff, man, thank you for sending this out. That means a lot. This was really cool. Fun to go through a lot of foils like that. I do appreciate it. Thank you. That is really sweet, man. Uh, uh, guys, uh, thanks again for tuning in. Jeff, I'm going to get this back to you soon. Appreciate you guys, my skadoosh bags. If you don't hit the like button, uh, it does help out a lot. Don't forget, hit the like uh, and uh, skadoosh, uh, my ninjas. Hopefully I'll see you on Twitch tonight. We'll see what's going on. We'll see you.